Concern rises in Kayunga over the increasing number of bodies being dumped in River Sezivua. This comes after the discovery of a fourth body under the bridge in just a month yesterday. The male victim's body was found by a fisherman who had gone for his early morning routine. No one has been arrested so far, but police has launched its investigations. The unidentified body was taken to Kayunga Hospital for post-mortem. Beside the body, there was a, a, a ship which was rotted, and uh, we managed to retrieve the body, uh, which we found completely naked. In Gulu, a 39-year-old woman who was on Tuesday this week admitted at St. Mary's Hospital at Cho after her body swelled, raising her weight to more than 300 kilograms, will have to brace herself for a full year's medical treatment if she is to recover. Doctors say Maureen Aya has a chronic respiratory failure, a condition that makes her retain more carbon dioxide, resulting into water retention in her body. No kidding, all liver problems have so far been identified, but doctors say they face a challenge of carrying out a complete and proper diagnosis because of her size. As we speak now, we are dealing with the emergent problems of respiratory failure and uh, the physical problems of movement.